It's really exciting to be back in the UK and I couldn't wait for this moment. <laughs> It was good for me to explore other opportunities outside and being in a different environment compared to the environment that I know. Obviously, I was earlier on with Loughborough Lightning and moving to Storm, that was, it was good for me to adventure elsewhere. Well, we tried pushing for it for years. It's, I call it, we almost won the trophy, which we did not. Um, seeing them lift the trophy last year actually um, brought it into fulfillment for me because that's something we worked for and we built up to years and getting that nailed down was really an excitement. A lot has changed in such a way that uh, it's really unpredictable who's going to win this year or who would have won last year and I think the league has grown from strength to strength and individual players have developed from strength to strength and it's really good to have that competitiveness in this league. Well, my new home has been made home away from home um, by my teammates and the management at Storm. They have really made it comfortable for me and I'm liking it. It's, it's lovely. And netball is a very amazing sport. It's something that personally I have treasured all my life and I've enjoyed the environment. Um, it's, it's just the, the family and the unity in netball is, is really amazing. And with the way netball is growing around the world now, it's even becoming more exciting for us that are almost going out and for the new generation that is coming in. Uh, it's becoming very exciting. And I just like the competitiveness and the aggressiveness that is getting into it. And to make it better, the friendship, the families that we have built in netball has made netball a very amazing sport. It's my hope that uh, we see more netball players come across. There are already many that have come across. Um, it's something that I, I credit England Netball and the Vitality Netball League for giving the opportunity to players that wouldn't make it to come over, explore something and develop themselves and develop their families with community back home is something that cannot be traded for anything. And on behalf of the African players, I would say we don't take it for granted because we know that this wouldn't have been possible if the opportunities were not opened. Um, yeah, it will really be good to see more players come and I strongly believe that more players will be in this league and this will also help develop other leagues around the world, which it's practically doing because Uganda has grown from strength to strength. Malawi has done the same. Zimbabwe had a player here and I believe she has learned something and she has carried the skill back home and will come back to develop herself more. And I mean, those are some of the things that netball is being treasured for. You, you can't see so many African players in other sports. Probably there are a few, one or two but that's, that's something that makes netball unique. The ability to develop individuals and become as a, a tool for sustainable development, that's something I treasure about netball and the women empowerment that is going on in netball. And to add on to that, now we can see diversity and inclusion in netball, which is something that we have always looked for and we have always wished to have, and for that we are grateful. <laughs> the name Mary alone makes me laugh because she's, like my young sister and I enjoyed uh, seeing her play and growing from strength to strength. Whether I will challenge her or not is, is difficult for me to tell but all I can say is we will both play our best and at the end it's all for the, our development and for the development of Uganda because this is talent being developed for the entire Uganda so either way is made the best win. <laughs> to me leaving a legacy is not all the trophies that I get, or all the medals that I get. It's having an impact in the life of somebody and being that light at the end of the tunnel. The ability, I mean the opportunity Netball has given me to speak on behalf of the people that cannot speak for, some, for themselves is something that I am I'm grateful for. And I enjoy it. To me, that is the legacy. The ability to develop someone and see the person grow is more important than the medals I get. And for that, that's, that's what I enjoy the most. <laughs>